Let me show you what this is. Okay. This is one of my favorites. When so you think excited. of crystals, mm -hmm. kids think of these kinds of crystals here. So this is a, uh, a crystal, like a, a sugar, sugar crystal. And you're supposed to take this crystal, this is one of those that uh, that I'm you hungry, make. Steve. And Are you hungry? <laughs> and then you put it in your coffee and you're supposed to spin it around. Right. And Holy freight, that's a lot of sugar, I know right? It, so, right, so, it is. All right, so um, that's, this is a saturated solution. You take sugar, you put it in water, and you keep on dissolving it until it doesn't dissolve anymore. There's that last little layer on the bottom. That's when that tea is the best, mm -hmm. right? Uh, and that's a saturated solution. Okay. But if you heat it up, it becomes a super saturated solution, right. moving those molecules apart. And that's what we did with these solutions that are here. Okay. So they're precariously placed. This is a salt here, and you can kind of see the salt here on the plate. Yeah. It's called sodium acetate. So I took that Ooh, and I little. kept on dissolving it, kept on dissolving it. So mm -hmm. here's what we have. And so let me hold it up here so you can kind of see. This is our solution of sodium acetate. And I have it covered here because even the tiniest little speck of dust will trip this. So watch this. I'm going to take it off. Right. And I want you to reach out and just get one tiny little crystal, just a single one. Show right. them on your finger. Just you a single, see. single little crystal I may that's have there. Like even just a couple. It's probably that's too many. That's it. And just reach over and you're going to just tap it right on the top. Ready? So just tap it on the top and you can kind of watch what oh, happens. Oh, cool. Isn't that just it's amazing. It's just spreading out. Kind of like when you see things freeze really Absolutely. Quickly. And so you've got crystal formation in there. Again, it's called sodium acetate trihydrate. And oh, that's, wow. isn't that, isn't that and just it's going gorgeous? Out the side. It's also Very exothermic. Cool. So put your hands around it. You'll be nice and warm. Oh, isn't that just amazing? Wow. So it's nice and warm for you to be able to see. That? <laughs> this is the stuff in hand warmers. Is it so really? now if you take this and put it in the microwave, I can turn it back into uh, to oh. that process as well. And so gotcha. we get crystal formation. You might even be able to see some crystal formation here. So watch this. I'm going to put a couple little crystals just right here on the uh, on the plate. Right. And then here, let me pour some of this in here and see if you can see some of that crystal formation. So right here in the very oh, middle. Oh, there it goes. Isn't that just gorgeous? Oh, my gosh. And it just Philly keeps on growing too. and keeps on growing keeps <laughs> on growing. There's a great discussion over at momslikeme.com mm -hmm. about science fair. And, uh, and mom's kind of posted and some ideas and some questions and so forth, and we're kind of monitoring that to kind of help them along the way. And how to do how to turn something like this into a project versus just a demonstration. Exactly. Big difference between a demonstration and a project, and our teachers and classrooms today need the help. There's just not enough time with all the things that they have to do, and so parents, this is a great time to kind of get your kids involved. Well, Steve, thank you so much. Fun. Great ideas this week. I love this one. It's so cool.